What is going on, everybody? Chris here. Forgot my mic. And we are back with another full self driving beta video on version 10. So, we're going to a little area here that was very nice uh, that I have dubbed Pedestrian Square. It's a little square we can just kind of go around a few times and see how the car is going to interact with pedestrians. It's lunchtime on the University of Michigan campus. And in the middle of this square is a lot of the restaurants and things. So lots of hungry students wandering about, not paying much attention. Uh, so we're going to go over there and, and test it out. And I will say I was pretty inspired. So slowing down for this speed bump here. I was pretty inspired by AI drivers last video. Now, keep in mind that Elon Musk has said beta is overfitted for California, parts of California. And so it does better in those areas. But man, he just <laughs> has the patience of a saint um, and just lets the car kind of sit there and, and do all these goofy things. Um, now, again, when the beta testers are driving without a video, we're intervening all the time, hitting the accelerator, taking over so that the autopilot team gets good data and makes the system better. But for the videos, we really want to test the car out and see what its capabilities are, where it's you know kind of lacking and things like that. So really nice stop and then moving left turn through this intersection. Awesome. Love it. Um, so I'm going to I'm going to do my best. <laughs> I may not have um, as as much of nerves of steel as, as he does, but um, I'm going to try to push the car really hard um, and let it do everything on its own, as long as it's safe, of course. If there's any safety reasons, I would, of course, take over. So slowing down for another speed bump here. So this is pretty much the start of it. We can see some people on the sidewalks wandering around, and there's a lot of crosswalks, and so mostly people will go across the crosswalks. But as you can see right here, uh, these people are not using crosswalks. We're not slowing down for them yet, and now we are. So now we're slowing down. Oh, okay, well, that's our destination. So let me put in the next destination here. It's gonna be um, a little <laughs> annoying. You're good, you're good, uh, because I have to keep putting in new destinations, but um, that's all right, we'll handle it. So. Put this next one in and i'll probably have to make this turn yeah it's gonna want to do oh no we can turn it on right here so we'll turn this on at this stop sign waiting for the pedestrians to cross so creeping up really good we got to be a little assertive here everybody's making eye contact with me as uh as i'm waiting they're making sure I'm going to go. So we have a cyclist to our right here and we get honked at and the car goes. <laughs> so I, I assume it did not um, go to that prompt of being honked at, but it did go when it was honked at. Uh, that cyclist on the right was nice to wait for us. We have another person here. Uh, they are not using a crosswalk, so it looks like they're just going to let us go because they technically don't have the right of way. We do have a few pedestrians here and the car does not wait for them. So they didn't seem to care at all. Uh, and if I was driving, I definitely would have stopped and let them cross. It's a crosswalk <laughs> that you always kind of give way to pedestrians, but the car didn't want to do that. I'm not sure if the trees were in the way or what. And then cyclist here, we are slowing down. Very good, very good. Um, is he going to go or not? So I, I have not done anything, and then the car stops. So that was a really good kind of preemptive. It sees the, the cyclist coming towards the crosswalk and then uh, lets them go. So I loved that. I'd love to see more of that. Uh, for pedestrians in the crosswalks. So this guy's just kind of hanging out with us. The car does not mind at all, takes off. Um, hmm, is that graphic new or were we just really close? <laughs> it looked it looked really nice, uh, the graphic of the cyclist there. So we did change the route there, a little obscured to the right, but they do have a stop sign, so the Tesla moves through, no problem. I'm Man, the, I'm telling you, the turning and moving through intersections, again, it's not done, obviously, it'll, it'll really never be done in my opinion, but it's, it's not perfect. It still sometimes will go too slow through them, but moving through intersections is so hugely improved in version 10, I, I really can't overstate it. All right, so this stop sign will be pretty difficult to the right. We have kind of a hill. It's kind of hard to see over there. And well, no, I guess the car can see fine. <laughs> we moved right through. Again, oh, the confidence is so good. Uh, we moved right through, it was completely clear. Great move. Minivan coming at us. Tesla doesn't mind. Slowing for this speed bump. Oh, and we stopped for this person. So uh, maybe not. <laughs> so uh, the car definitely was gonna stop, but it's just those little kind of weird interactions 
um, between people, and then again waiting for this person, where the car moved just barely, and then I was directly making eye contact with her, but she's not gonna trust that. She sees my car is moving, she's not gonna step in front of it. So again, we have the stop sign, people walking in front. <clears throat> and if, if people are more assertive, it works much better. If they're kind of timid, uh, it doesn't work so well. So now we need to go. Oh, okay, well, good. Oh, no, and then hitting the brakes and going. Uh, okay, so kind of awkward there. Um, not sure why. And then waiting for our turn. That popped up for a second. It's a little slow through there. I don't know if it was gonna wait for the bus, even though the bus was at a stop sign. Um, an alarm for no reason, turn signal, okay, <laughs> now, yeah, so so the system's sometimes a little bit of a mess when there's a lot going on, um, like in that stop sign. So that stop sign's really good. There's just so much going on there, we can really trip it up. So here we go, we do have some more people coming out. So this guy's gonna walk right in front of us, really confidently, that's, that's <laughs> the, the car works much better with that uh, than kind of as you saw with that woman before the you know, kind of back and forth. And moves right through the intersection. Whenever it's an all-way stop, so it's three-way stop for three lanes, the car is very confident after it makes it stop and it's clear. When you have cross traffic that doesn't stop, that's when the car can be a little more timid. So here's a scenario where, uh, like before, you know, I said it was going to be difficult and it did fine, but cross traffic here does not stop. They don't have a stop sign. So the car sometimes is too timid, although it wasn't on the last left turn. Uh, we do have a car to the right. Can't tell. There you go. That's displayed. To the left, we have somebody and we're, we're inching out, which is good. Yep. Keep inching, keep inching. And oh, okay. So they turn left, but they didn't have a turn signal on. So how was I supposed to know? Nobody knows. The car's still inching out and it's clear and it needs to go needs to go all right i have to hit the accelerator there sorry i tried <laughs> but you know somebody's driving towards us um, and and we need to get out of the way so we'll report that one um not very good on that turn so yeah that's the timid and timidness i was talking about when cross traffic doesn't stop it just went a little too slow Hi. slowing down for these people in the road i did a good job there of changing the route <laughs> on time unlike the past two times there you go a lot of people to the left there waiting at the bus stop we can see how many of them are rendered. Not that many. So stop, it's clear here, so we should be able to just go for it. Let's go, go, go. Go, go, go. Yeah, a little slow, but you know, being careful, th that was fine, that was fine. Um, just again, thinking about confusing people. Waiting for her, very good. Moving around the bus. So yep, should have stopped for that guy back there. Uh, he, again, he just was kind of standing there. I think the car, I'm actually gonna report that. The car definitely should have been waiting for him to, to cross when he was waiting there. I actually don't know. I'm sure you will all tell me in the comments. I'm not sure what the rule is like at a, okay. I don't know what we're waiting for here. Um, yeah, <laughs> that was terrible. Um, I actually couldn't really tell if anybody was over there. So it is our turn. So now we need to go. Okay, now the car's gonna go. Uh, I think we were there well, so I think we were there where, we were there well before the car to our right, um, but the Tesla waited so long, they ended up just going, um, but still not very good. Uh, so I don't know what the rule is if, if a pedestrian, you know, like in, in this case right here, it says pedestrians are crossing here. If they're just standing off to the right and, and not moving towards the crosswalk, am I supposed to stop for them? Um, again, like I said, that's what I would do. I don't know if I legally have to do that though. So pretty interesting. Uh, I think for self-driving cars though, they need to err way on the side of caution and, and stop for everybody. Which <laughs> in, in busy cities will, will be difficult because the, you know, the self-driving cars will just never go. Uh, around here, probably not as big of a deal. Okay, back here, completely clear. Oh, no, I'm wrong. <laughs> see, I don't see everything. Uh, there was a car to the right, and now it's completely clear, and beautiful, like, perfect left turn there. So it's strange to see, you know, the timidness on the same turn, you know, when you do it over and over again like that. Perfectly executed there. Stopped at the stop sign. 
people cleared, moved right through. Bam. If like if we could have okay, and then slowing, waiting for our turn. Like why is it slowing here? I, I don't really understand. Um, if we could, ha <laughs> never mind. <laughs> it screwed up. I was gonna say it was really good, but it wasn't. So I don't want that every time. That would be bad. Stopping at the stop sign. It's clear this cyclist. Okay, good. Is gonna come across to me. Wasn't sure if the car was gonna respond appropriately, but it definitely waited perfectly for them and moved through. So let's uh, go through this square one more time and then just pick a destination close by so we can get a kind of A to B in this test and then we can call it there. So back here, this intersection has performed perfectly a couple of times and then terrible the one the last time was really bad. Um, so we're here and, okay, good. And he, uh, sorry about that, sir. Okay, <laughs> he would be angrier, but he didn't seem to care. Um, so again, I'm reporting that because he obviously was gonna come through uh, and the car just didn't care at all. So we stop here, we have somebody crossing, car handles it perfectly. It actually says it's creeping. Um, I, I would assume it won't move while someone's in front of it, which is good. There, now it starts creeping. There's somebody to the right. They are turning left, so we'll have to wait for them. So I would have pulled out more than this. Um, definitely more, oh, okay. And then I have to hit the brake there because it almost pulled out in front of somebody and then turn it back on, so. So we have the left turn signal on. What the heck? We're going into the left turn lane, even though the nav obviously says to go right. We now have the right turn signal on. Okay, well, let's see what it does. We have a green arrow here. Luckily, the path planner is showing left, even though the right turn signal is on. And it is going to proceed through this left turn, so that's good. I'm still incredibly confused right now. Um, <laughs> okay, so it rerouted, so that's cool. But what the heck? <laughs> uh, well, if you got to make a mistake, I guess that's a pretty graceful one to make. So we're going back through this part of pedestrian square. Um, I didn't go the other way. I, I could have went the other way around, but I figured everybody would want to see left turns more than right turns. So we have to wait for this bus to get out of the way. Then we can go. Nope, that person's gonna go, even though it was our turn, but you know, we're not moving, so what do we expect? And then we have a couple of pedestrians. So again, here I would be moving out. Otherwise you'll never go anywhere. And now, there we go, just like this, just like that. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I mean, once it started going, <laughs> it took too long to make the move, but once it made the move, it was really nice. So then I am going to, so we're going around that cone, which is good. We're going too fast, slowing for her, that's good. Okay, it did change the speed limit back down. I don't know why it changed it to 30, uh, when nowhere around here was 30. So we have a stop sign here that it does not see. That's pretty crazy. Um, and of course, I'm not gonna see like here. That person's kind of far away, but obviously I'm letting them go. Like, <laughs> I would not go through there. So we'll turn this back on, waiting for our turn, and then we do move through. A little slow, not terrible. Moving into this lane, kind of dumb. You're not supposed to do that in the intersection. So I've, I hear every video <laughs> in the comments.
Now we make the correct right turn. No idea what happened before. The car just decided it wanted to do one more loop, I guess. Uh, and then getting to this destination should be fairly simple. I'm actually gonna put in a separate destination. U-turns are actually illegal in Michigan. This is called the Michigan left. We should have had our turn signal on way earlier than that. See how it does here. Um, older versions of beta have done Michigan lefts, but it's been kind of hit or miss. And I'm going to hit the brake there because that was no good. And that was a cop. <laughs> oh my gosh. Just uh, a little too aggressive. The aggressiveness is good and bad. <laughs> Depends on the situation. I hit the accelerator for that one, hate to tell you.